We are teaching the next wave of frontline workers. The need right now for not only EMTs, but more specifically paramedics is great. And it's, it's really COVID driven. I made the decision to join the program in the middle of the pandemic as we started in August. And obviously the instructors all worked super hard to make sure we were safe and everything was clean and there was no procedures in place. So I always felt secure and taken care of. Every situation that got hard, every time it looked like another door closed, they went around the corner and kicked in a window. And they found a way to get us through this and find us opportunities and continue to constantly adapt and change the program. I thought the program was going to have to end just because of all the uh, physical skills that we have to learn that comes along with being the EMT. The safety protocols that they took, we were able to stay safe throughout the whole process. We were able to stay in the classroom and learn what we have to learn and be able to do the hands-on stuff we need to do. Unfortunately, this class has seen the brunt share of the, the impact from COVID-19, and yet they are finishing as an, as an aggregate average within their class above the 90th percentile. I think the biggest challenge is just uh, maintaining uh, some type of normalcy uh, amidst this pandemic. So encouraging the students to uh, continue their coursework, studying. The silver lining out of this entire thing really is that it really forced us and forced our hand to embrace technology. It forced us to embrace alternative delivery methods. But now we can leverage that skill set to better serve our students downstream.